of all shapes, sizes, and colors flying high over Mobile. The sky clear, the wind blowing just right, and the sun shining at Battleship Memorial Park, making for perfect kite flying conditions. Trees and buildings and battleships can create turbulence, and right now we've got the wind coming out of a pretty decent direction. It's all about catching the wind at the right moment. Long gone are the days of running with a kite. I don't run, you know. Uh, you just need a good wind. Jason Wheeler has been flying kites for more than 25 years and says it's relaxing and even therapeutic. It's, it's like an escape, you know, you put your headphones in and you're flying, it's you and your kite, you know, you don't think about the bills and all that stuff. It was a beautiful sight indeed, as families spent the day figuring out how to keep the kite soaring. The Ford Green family chose to celebrate their daughter Riley's sixth birthday during Kites Over Mobile. We were planning to do a park birthday and we saw that the kite festival was going on at the same time, so we were like, let's go ahead and just bring the party to the kite festival. The family was pleasantly surprised with how big the event was, even having kite making as one of their birthday party activities. I didn't know the event was this big. But when we went to Party City to get the balloons and we saw other people getting kites at the same time, we knew it was going to be probably big. Birthday girl Riley giving her birthday party and all the kites at the festival two thumbs up. Octopus one. I see that octopus one. It's cool. In Mobile, Gianni Navarro, Fox 10 News.